Hi there, I'm Mickey Mouse. So, you're probably wondering what happened after Diesel 10 got sentenced away from Sodor. Well, we're about to show you, right now. Meet all of the Fat Controller's engines. They're all in the sheds. Henry went to crew and got a new shape after Diesel 10 knocked him over. Now he looks like this. All of the engines live happily here, and the Fat Control is on holiday, so we've got a new person here, a Roblox man. Look, I just came out of the virtual reality world into the real world to control with you guys, so I guess I should start with the rounds. Thomas, you are to collect milk and take it to the tracks. Okay, sir. One by one, the engines left doing their important jobs. Thomas began doing his job. While the new controller, while the temporary controller just sat in the corner. Those engines do seem pretty useful, I guess. Thomas arrived at the station. Gordon was not happy. <sighs> What's wrong, Gordon? Changes have been made. I am now pulling these trucks instead. Oh, Gordon, pulling trucks can't be that bad. <laughs> well, you're just a little weakling. Doesn't it feel like we did this some other time? What, you mean 22 years ago when Diesel 10 came through? Yeah, that's what it feels like. Oh, well, don't worry, Thomas, I can assure you Diesel 10 won't come right now. Oh, I'm back! Happy to see me! <laughs> I'm back! Look at my new look! I look totally better. But why did you get that look? Well, let's re some. Let's summarize up a bit. So last time, so last time, I got thrown off the island for destroying that tree, right? But now, look at me. I'm better now. Well, so long. And I'm, and my plan this time is to destroy you. So you won't be able to destroy my plan. And it's Christmas Day. <laughs> a few days later, the engines were happy, but Thomas was getting a bit scared. Thomas was shunting trucks in the yard all day, when suddenly, none other than Diesel 10 pulled up. <laughs> Thomas, look what I've got. I've got new minions. Do you mean... No, they're not back, are they? We're back. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> Splodge, you're back. Well, actually, I'm Spla, and I'm Dodge. I ain't got time to say both names. I thought I made that clear. But anyways, they were there 22 years ago. Now they're back, and this time they'll obey me. Yeah, I don't think so. Bye. Arrgh. Sleep with one eye open, Puffball. You're not gonna like tonight. Well, how come you didn't stop them? Oh, um, yeah, you, well, well, you see, the thing is, uh, no excuses. Why didn't you stop them? Um, well, uh, boss, um, you see, we don't really like you that much. Yeah, we don't. Hey, where are you going? Just off to the yard to shun some trucks. <laughs> <laughs> That'll be fun. Pinchy. Thomas continued jumping trucks for the rest of the day. Bingo. Triple bingo. Thomas made a train that he would pull the next day. But now, it's time to get to sleep. Oh, hi there. Hi, I just want to say, you engines do pretty good at your job. Well, thank you. Just then Gordon pulled in. Ugh. What's wrong, Gordon? Another good train I had to pull today. People don't realise what I suffer. Then Percy came in. Oh, cheer up, Gordon. It's not all bad. Oh, Percy, it is all bad. Nothing good's happened today. Later on, all the other engines came. All of the engines were getting some sleep. And the new controller walked out. 
So, uh, boss, did you say you are going to get him right now? Yes, yeah, so I'm going to get him right now, okay? Stay behind. You're not going to like this one, Puffball. <laughs> sometimes I wonder if he's going insane. Yes, yeah, sometimes I wonder that too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just because I'm puffing away doesn't mean I'm not deaf, you two. Oh, he really got us there, yeah. However, Diesel 10's plan didn't really go to according to plan, you should say. Let's see how it goes. Diesel 10's plan was to get Thomas while he was asleep, but Thomas had to puff off in the middle of the night to get the trucks. <laughs> Wait, where's Thomas? Uh, he went out to shunt trucks. What? He was, I was meant to, um, uh, nothing. All right, I'm thanks. Thomas was pulling them across the line. That's him. Get him. Uh-oh. <laughs> Diesel 10 raised his claw, but then this happened. <laughs> Who is this? Gordon, what are you doing here? said Thomas. Yeah, what are you doing here, Gordon? Hmm, I know what you're doing, so I have a message to you. Hello, I'm Gordon. Oh yeah, well I'm Diesel 10. You're not going to get past my trick. I'm going to destroy Thomas. Just then Percy came up as well. And um, we're not going to stick for it. Ugh. Get the joke stick, because we're... No. Oh, Percy, you do terrible jokes. I agree. <sighs> oh. Diesel 10 was pushed back. He didn't like this. He tried to get to Thomas, but they were blocking his way. Do you know what? Make the most of tonight, Thomas. You're not going to like tomorrow. Diesel 10 went back to his sheds, and so did the other engines. Do do do. I hope he doesn't actually destroy Thomas. I know, that would be a catastrophe. Imagine Thomas, of all legends, getting destroyed. The most useful one on the line, aside from me. Because obviously I'm the most important engine of all. And he puffed out of the station proudly. Uh, Gordon, you're not going anywhere. Oh yes, yeah, so Gordon. I do hate you, Percy. The next morning, Thomas was still tired from what he did last night. So he was sleep, so he was sleep dreaming. Uh, this meant he was having a dream while he was awake. Or in other words, daydreaming. He was half asleep and he was going down the line. Oh. Thomas, get back here. It's not safe out there. Whoa. <laughs> Easy there, Douglas. I know what it is. Yes, it's dangerous out here, Thomas. And Henry, stop doing that. Thomas didn't realise that the other engines were backing him up because of what happened with these and him last night. <laughs> Rise and shine, Splodge. For the last time, it's Splatter and Dodge. And we're next. I ain't got time to say both names. I thought I made that clear. Now you two go get Thomas while I have my lazy si I mean, uh, I ain't eh, lazy. I'm not lazy. Just go get him. Okay. You're the boss. Twinkle toes. I heard that. Come on, said Splitter. Dodge helped up behind. All right, Thomas. You got him with the next dodge. Yep, Splatter, ready to push. Hey, where are you taking me? Where are you taking me? To Diesel Town. What do you mean? Why, why are you doing that? Dodge decided to make room at the engine's house, but they didn't like it. Alright, alright, I'm going. Jesus, engines are really bad. They were still taking Thomas when they arrived there. Oh, get off of me! <gasps> <laughs> oh, Thomas. Dodge, get off of him. For the love of God, it's Splatter and Dodge, not Splodge. What do you want with me? I only want to destroy you so you won't wreck my plan. Um, 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 
Bye bye, Twinkle Toes. No, Gordon, help me. Express coming through. Uh, Express coming through. Oh, wow. Gordon hit into him, saying his catchphrase, Express coming through. Uh, get off. Oh, 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 so good. That's what you get for her messing with little Thomas. I'm not little, Gordon. Yeah, I might be smaller than you, but come on, I can do work better than you. Oh, no, you can't. I'm the most important in the sheds. What do you mean? Well, um, you see, Tom, what is it, everybody? Um, Gordon's more important. Why does everyone think that? You know what? I'm going to get Diesel 10. I'm going to show you. Wait, no, Thomas, wait. It's dangerous. He wants to get you. So what if he wants to get me? I should return the favour and get him instead. Returning the favour? I'm not sure that's how you say it, Thomas. Right, Diesel 10. <laughs> you want to get me? <laughs> Silly little engine. You could never get me. He didn't realise Percy went up to the back to push him out so Thomas could hit him. Splodder and Dodge knew this, but they decided not to tell him after calling him Splodge. Alright then, come get me. Well, actually, I'm not going to, but Percy will. Huh, Percy? Who's Percy? Ah! Oh! No, said Thomas. Why have you? Diesel 10 once again thought they wanted to fight. Alright, you want to? Then Gordon did his catchphrase again. Oh no, I know what this is. Oh, for the love of God. I know what that means now. Whenever that happens, I'll just get rid of you. <laughs> this is where the train wars really begin. Part 2 of the story. The next day, the new controller was giving out all of the orders. Thomas, you are to take a very important train. And don't mess up, it is one of the most important on the island. Then all the other engines went away to do their jobs that they were informed. Here was the train. Thomas had to push it. All right, boys, my plans come to action. Um, but boss, what is it? We don't want to work for you anymore. You will work for me, okay? Now, listen. Thomas was pulling the train. <laughs> he had to stop, though, because this was the ocean. Diesel 10 was about to hit him. Whoa! Thomas's trucks fell into the ocean. <laughs> The new controller was not pleased. Thomas, what did you do? It wasn't me, it was it was probably Splatter or Dodge or Diesel 10. Don't blame them. I know it was you that did it on purpose. <laughs> How was that one, boys? Good, but um, can we please have a, a day off, maybe? Because, you know, it's, it's Boxing Day. Or Listen, I don't need your excuses. Now, just watch what I'm about to do. The trucks got hoisted out of the sea, but by then it, it was already getting to close to night time. Well, I suppose I'll have to pull this. But then the new controller informed him. No, Thomas, don't pull it. <sighs> just go to the sheds. All of the other engines came to the sheds as well that night. Well, Thomas, I heard you couldn't pull your trucks correctly. Look, Gordon, it wasn't me, I swear. I really do think that you can't pull them, Thomas. You should get a lesson. Exactly, Thomas. But it wasn't me, it was Splatter or Dodge or Diesel 10. If it was Splatter, Dodge or Diesel 10, where are they now? Well, I don't know where Diesel 10 is, but it was probably Splatter and Dodge. Do you know what? I'm going to tell the con controller that it was probably Splatter or Dodge. No, Thomas, you're just getting more trouble for lying. I'm not lying. Controller, it was probably Splatter or Dodge. Oh, look, I've had enough, Thomas. Just go away. Thomas was sad that he was not believing in him. <sighs> Then James came in. 
What's that? Um, what's wrong, Thomas? They think I pushed the trucks into the sea when it wasn't me. <laughs> Big old diesel has a plan. E I I can <laughs> What's that all about? I have no clue. In the morning, Thomas was told that he had to go collect the trucks. <laughs> <laughs> that little blue puff ball's on his way. It's now your time, Splodge. Um, it, it's the 27th. Can we get the day off? No, you cannot get the day off. Go do it or, I'm, or else I'm gonna scrap you. Okay, okay, okay. No one asked you to be bossy. And I heard that! So what did Boss tell us to do? I don't know, he said something about delaying Thomas. Just delay Thomas! Okay, yeah, I suppose then. Whoa! Quick, let's get out of the scene of crime. <laughs> this is actually pretty fun. See, I told you it was fun. You just had to believe in me. Yeah, Boss, but... We quit. What? You quit? You're not allowed. Ah. Thomas! Again, just go to the shop. I'm sending someone else to do it in the next morning. Thomas was third. Uh, don't worry, Thomas. This time we know it wasn't your fault. And neither was it last time. No, we think last time it was your fault, but this time it wasn't your fault. We've seen Splatter and Dodge. Henry decided to go take it. Wait, Henry, don't. You'll just get delayed. That night when all of the other engines were asleep... Thomas puffed out the sheds to do it in secret at midnight. Little did he know, but Diesel Hem was watching him. <laughs> then Diesel Ten tried to scare him. He honked his horn. Ah, ah, someone's here. Ah. Oh, the other engines heard it. Oh no, not again. Ugh. Then Diesel 10 decided to do this. You know what, Thomas? You better start running. Go, Thomas, go, said the other engines. Thomas went away. Oh no. Do you know, son? I'm going with him. Thomas was being chased down by Diesel 10. Coming! No! No! <laughs> then Percy came. Don't worry, Thomas, I'm here to rescue you. But Percy, you don't have a coupling like Diesel 10. You can't stop him. I'm coming after you! <laughs> Splatter and Dodge came to get Percy out of the way. Right, come on. No! No! <laughs> yeah, we'll help you, boss. Percy decided to help Thomas. <laughs> Hoist me, boys! <laughs> yeah. It looks like I'm getting a green puff ball instead. Um, bye. Oh, Percy, you... Mm. Thomas was going at the speed of light. I'm coming. No, no, it's not like this. Diesel Tam was about to get Thomas when this happened. Bum, bum, bum. That's it, Diesel 10. Uh, why are you chasing Thomas? Uh, well, um, y you see, he stole something of mine. Thomas, is this true? No, sir. No, sir. No, sir, no, sir, no, sir, no, sir, no, sir. <gasps> no, sir, no, sir. Date the splodge! That's what you get for calling us splodge. It's splatter and dodge. <sighs> Diesel 10. Had to go to the sheds to think about what he did. But Thomas and Percy went back to their sheds. Then the fat controller came back. Spider and Dodge decided that they would keep in comfort. So, um, boss, I, I think um, this time we can quit. <sighs> However, there was a new one that was about to puff up. <laughs> You will have to see that next time.